Hey guys and girls, it's Ginger here back with another video. Oh, that's an interesting book. My that's reader is saying that the gem is somewhere inside. And today, I am going to be teaching you guys how to finish Mummy Mystery. Um, so yeah, for me, it's easier than, um... Oh, that's me. Oh, I wonder how handsome that guy is. So, <laughs> so today we're going to be... I've never seen anything like this. True, true. I mean, I have, but in real life. So I'm going to be teaching you guys how to complete this map without dying, and I'm not going to make any cuts. Any cuts. Not even one. So that's the easy part. Just get a slingshot and... Yeah, yeah, you know what to do. I'm not going to, like, teach you guys from that, but... We're in the game, so we're in the game. So most of these guys are going to die, because they look like noobs. Yeah. So they are probably going to die. Let's go and search for the key. I'm not going to make any cuts when I'm finding a key as well, because, uh... You guys need to know where the key locations are. Here's one, here's one location. Around this area is one. That's uh, most of them, I think, that I know. The artifacts are quite easy if you're good at your beast. Hold on, hold on. Where is the key though? What, it should be up here sometimes. Oh, someone else found it. Oh, it's actually there. Oh, nice. So I'm gonna actually drink some water while Tim takes ages to open this door. But guys, and I took uh, my air conditioning remote on, on, on top of my printer so that it's like um, it, so I remember when I get 20 pumps. And the but mainly to beat this map, what it's all about is to um um practice, keep on practicing the obbies. So for this one, I don't think you're gonna die until the obbies. Yeah, that's the hard part. So what you're gonna wanna do if you want, if you haven't seen the mummy thingy, I'm not gonna spoil anything. If you haven't seen that, stand here and just watch it. He won't kill you. Just um when you. Tim says, bro, and just come here straight and just- My turn. power reader is off the charts! Yeah, Tim. I think this is the most powerful gem yet. Wild, Wild West is supposed Much to- Much is happening! Wild West is supposed to get released today. Hold on, I'll just show you guys the money if you haven't seen it. Who cares? I think you guys, most of you guys have seen the gameplay video I did. You got the gem, I believe. Yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's what it is. And now we'll just go look at it. He's gonna open up with the full down. Oh. A new sound tower! Hold on, guys, I just messed up. The water is everywhere. <laughs> yeah, now it's gonna collapse. you guys how to survive this i mean you don't have to you just push these blocks like i'll get all that sony sony do it so then yeah just push the blocks to the respective colors don't just push them randomly push them to the colors yeah yeah i'll, I'll let the bacon head do it come on bacon head you can do this oh never mind so come on see if it's stuck like this push it to the side somewhere and then yeah there we go oh no it's not Push it to the back a little. Now Bacon Head should be able to push it. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Bacon Head. Never mind. I'll just do it myself. Hold it. Okay, push it straight. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Like that. Now we should be able to push it if we, uh... This is the hard part. The OB. I'm not gonna tell. I'm not gonna tell anything to these guys. Like, oh, stop it! You're gonna die or something. Oh, that was a major frame li frame lag. So, what, so I'm gonna teach you guys. So, th this is the part where most of you guys are struggling. Get up here! Get up here! Just hold the W key until you get like this. Hold on. Yeah, like this. Now press S and backspace quickly. Yes. Now jump, jump, jump. Here's the other hard part. Not this over here. 
go to the edge right and jump oh no we actually um failed it but 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 that we can still do it again because i mean like unless the other song sony are uh, then the uh, so now we know that everyone's a noob in this server like i said oh I was actually using a different mouse, so I actually thought I was gonna die. So let me try. Oh, you can actually do it like that as well. Oh, interesting. I think we actually fell down in this bit. Come on, Sony, don't die. I got us. Oh, we actually got two people alive. We all we all died once. Now I will take what is most important. We have a really bad situation here. I I I I made He's my head making me dance to death. Everything. He's right here now. Uh can we get teleported? Okay guys, so we're here now. And for you guys, we actually like managed to um let's go and um kill the legit man P. Mm, yeah, we actually I actually my headphones didn't get wet. It's only my files of for my drawings, I love art. So I keep them there. And um so um what you're gonna wanna do now I'm gonna call my interdimensional radio world. What you gonna do now is gonna um, Oh that's not the time. My graphics quality, what am I doing? No, three three. So now you're gonna walk straight up um follow the path from the oasis. Yeah. Distress beacon tin. Sorry guys, I'm a little sick. Just follow the path. Don't go there, don't go there. Of course, you're not gonna be like blind or something to spot this part in path and just a city there, like a mini gateway and stuff. So go to Jake now. I don't know if there are some guards, so I'm probably gonna die in that obby as well, the sand one, because it's been a while since I played this. So yeah, but 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 I do know how to do it. Okay, so I walk up to Jake and click on this pad. Click on this pad until he talks. Now, now, follow me. Follow me. Hold on, guys. Let me just do one, one last check if uh, everything's not wet. We're all good. And I know this is the most inappropriate time to like check if everything's wet or not. So we'll go back to the oasis now. Yes, the exact same one you came from. Even Jake says it. So you'll, you'll see a monkey here or there. I'll show you guys. And not literally like a here or there, like the word, but literally I'll show you guys here along this path or there along that path. But there we go, there's the monkey. Just in case you guys had trouble finding it, and no one's gonna have trouble finding the key. Like, come on, come on, who will? Um, so, actually, we gotta return the monkey to Jake. I think I'm faster than, um, I don't know. No. <laughs> what does he mean by no? I don't know what he means. Racing. No, what does he mean? Come on, Jake. Paul. <laughs> Okay, see you. Now I gotta go tell the guards that um he sent us. He he. Well, if Jake said you can pass, walk through. Is that Creekcraft? It's not like Creekcraft. 
So now I just don't care what this Dr. Time says, but follow me, follow me, follow the path, I guess. Rather, yeah, that, you can say that. Yeah, it's not this. Yeah, it's coming from this temple, but you don't have to go inside it yet. Oh no. Just follow and go over to the uh, to teleportation machine or something. Blah, blah, blah. So the uh, update hasn't dropped yet, but it's the same day. Look, look, he's all the way back. Can't even see him. Has he even crossed? A pyramid with a blue door. Oh no! No, this is only us. Sorry, racing key. Oh yeah, you sent us a friend with us. I will always remember you. So the boss fight is up to you guys. It's up to you whether you survive or it depends on if you have. So I'm just gonna I'll do a quick talk here before I um unleash the power of the sand. So basically, after this is the boss fight. I mean, like after the maze and the lobby and all that. So you're not gonna die in the other lobby unless you glitch out. But but just be careful. Yeah yeah, just be careful. Just saying. Because I died in it once because I glitched. So so. Before I click on this key, I'm going to tell you guys some few things. So the boss battle, don't ask me how you finish it. It depends on uh, how many people live. If there's a lot of people living with you, then you're good. If it's only you and you have two lives, you might be able to kill them. But I guess you need like 25 or 25 Robux. If you have two lives and you're alone. But if you're with someone and you die zero times. And if you're with like a group of people and you die zero times. Then you're winning that boss fight. So just don't waste your time unless you're really skilled at dodgy or something. So now, now, we're gonna go and click on the key and do the obi. We're probably gonna die pretty soon, so I'll keep quiet. Robux. Yeah. Be very careful on that uh, on that little one right over there. See, so yeah, every everything's quite easy in this lobby. You just make sure you don't speed run off to that part. I try to speed run, so that's why I died basically, because I speed run it. But anyways, before I go on, let me just give you a few tips on this. Um, so basically, the reason I died was because yeah, of course, of course, I haven't been playing in a long time, but there's another reason because. If you saw that jump I died in, it's a pretty big one, if you didn't see. So you gotta time it perfectly and jump at the edge, or else you would like... Yeah, that's over. If, if... Just time it perfectly on the edge. I know what I'm saying, I know what I'm saying. I've done that sand lobby thousands of times. I mean, like, more than you. I've, I've done it, like, i played, like, literally, I spent 10 hours or something in this game, on this specific map trying to become good at it now I just got rusty in this map because I'm, I'm it's like extinction basically I'm good at it but yeah so I'm not gonna make one on extinction because probably most of you guys are good at it and there's probably gonna be a guy who carries you in the lobby now follow me exactly right here don't be spooked out by this go this way guys first left you go go right go straight then I go here the second intersection and then uh, you should go here, and then go here. This one, I mean, if you need to pause the video, then sure. Okay, then so here you're just gonna turn like this, and then turn another turn like that. Don't mind the what's here, just come by this way. Go left again, go left, go right, go left, go right. I think this is the end, right? Yeah. So here it is. Now it's time for me a hard obby. So what I'm going to do after this will be is I'm going to end the video here yeah, because the boss fight is up to you. But I'll give it a shot um, because yeah, you, you, it's, it's not up to you to decide if you can survive it or not. Let me just keep quiet because I might muck up again. Okay, 
kidding guys, we actually made it, and now it's time for the boss fight. I'll give it a shot, I'll give it a shot, why not, why not? For the sand derby guys, again, just make sure you get that one jump, one jump correctly, and then you should stop speedrunning once you get to that one jump. Just take your time, I mean like just one second or something, like two seconds. And then um, make it perfectly, and then you can um, go a little bit faster, but don't speedrun it, because if you speedrun it, you'll die, that's all I can say. And um, yeah. If you, if you speedrun it after that bit, you'll die. That like like I did. Try to speedrun that jump, but I didn't time it perfectly, so I died. Look at Jim. Yeah. So Tim is Jim's brother. No, Tim is um, Jim's interdimensional twin, evil twin. So hold on, I'll call you guys back once all this. Talk, talking thing is done because of yeah okay guys it's almost time to kill Manny um so what you're gonna wanna do is go in first person to deal most damage to get your foot back to really. you're probably gonna take like first hit or something already make sure to aim all of your shots don't try and run away from him because you're gonna obviously get killed by him pretty, um, pretty soon just try and hit him in the chest that's his weak spot. I mean, not like literally a weak spot, but yeah, that's where you can kill him. I might have to spend some robux here. We're doing quite a good amount, of, uh, quite a good amount of health here. I know you're gonna be like, hey, Ginger, you're losing health, though. Be careful. But, 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 try to get as much as you can, as much damage as you can. We can top what uh, us. Oh no, he did. If you have the big stuff, then that's pretty good, that's pretty good. I probably did like 750 damage to him by now. So yeah, just keep doing this and you might be able to like uh, do a lot of damage. So yeah, I'm probably gonna have to spend like 1 Robux, 25 Robux or something. Again, yeah, I'll spend it, why not, why not. Just for like, just for like this one though, just for like this one. Now we can go straight and aim our shots. Because, yeah, the, yeah, the thing I'm going to say to you guys again is that wait wait for it and shoot. Don't rush it. Don't rush it. If you rush it, then, yeah, yeah, basically, yeah, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm trying to say. If you rush it, you oof. If you rush it, you oof. Big oof. Might have to spend uh, another few couple of Robux, but, but it's okay. It's okay, I mean like, it's okay, who cares, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Oh, no, we're gonna have to spend some Robux, definitely, definitely, here at this point. Let's just try to do as much damage as we can to prevent us from dying. I'll be so mad if we have to spend some Robux here. There we go, we did it guys. I only spent it once, once, only once. Is he glitched? Is he move? Okay guys, and I just click on this gem. No, but before you click on it, we, we you have to dance on the gem. <laughs> okay, you have to dance on the gem and shoot him in the head because he's such a goof head. He messes up at everything. Now press the gem. So yeah guys, if you did watch <laughs> I am alive. <laughs> if you guys did what I did like only spend twenty five Robux on this but fifty in total but I should have only spent twenty five because the sand obby is just my fault. It's my fault literally. I messed up. And so yeah, that is how you complete it. Um any anyways guys, you are you are gonna have to exit so I'll teach you guys how you exit. Go on the edge here, make sure you don't like fall off. Don't take the other side. Don't take the other part. Oh no! This is the part! Yeah. I actually thought I was gonna die there, guys, for a second. I didn't die. That was so lucky of me. <laughs> uh, so here it's kind of like backtracking, just. Yeah, just go, yeah. For the boss fight again, as you can see, I, I saw a lot of YouTubers spend like 
75 Robux for the boss fight, but I only spent 25. You know why? Do you want to know why? Because, follow me, follow me, while I'm talking as well. Um, because, oh, because I aimed my shots. If you guys just, if you guys go in, um, this mode, it's harder. If you go in first person, you can see, like, you can move, it's pretty straight and accurate where you're going to want to shoot. Just, and just uh, don't shoot in the corners, it'll take you a longer reload time and then you'll take more damage. If you shoot shoot on the, 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 the uh, when Manny's like following you like this and straight, if you're turning like this, you're probably gonna miss your the shot. The like, rushing yeah. through my veins. Of course it is, Ken, you just got revived, you just died. So yeah guys, right after this is the ending, the ending of Mummy Mystery. So what I'm gonna do now, right now, is um, yeah, I'm gonna end the video here because that's what they, you just could walk through that portal. But if you are new and you want um, a guide on how to finish Wild West, make sure to hit that like button and smash that subscribe button. Bye.